Zippity zipper in the windy day. It was Zippity Zebra's washing day. One nice clean shirt, he counted. One spotless scarf, one whoosh. Suddenly, a huge gust of wind blew all Zippity's clothes up in the air towards the street. Oh no, yelled Zippity. Dear me, said Miss Cheetah. We'd better go after them. Zippity and Miss Cheetah were racing down the street when they spotted Dr. Draft in his car. I've lost all of my clothes, wailed Zippity. The Dr. Draft pointed at the road. Look, he said. It's my shirt, Zippity squealed happily. Further down the road, Mr. Elephant was reading his newspaper. Hey, called Zippity, have you seen any of my clothes? Mr. Elephant peeled his sock off his paper. I thought the news looked strange today, he chuckled. <laughs> I'd better come and help you. As the four friends passed Professor Croc's house, they heard the sound of music. I've lost all my clothes, called Zippity. Have you seen any blown past? I wondered why my notes sounded odd, replied Professor Croc. This must be your tie. The five friends arrived at the town hall. What was Major Monkey laughing at? That is not a flag, giggled Zippity. Major Monkey joined the search party. It wasn't long before they spotted a scarf in Lenny Lyon's front garden. A jacket outside Papa Penguin's this shop. And a hat at Madame Hippo's cafe. Thank you everyone, Grim Zippity. I'm very lucky to have such good friends. Then everybody sat down for a well-deserved treat. Suddenly, a huge gust of wind blew their hats high in the air. Whoosh! Oh no, they all yelled. Here we go again!